Back in the day, before smartphones turned us all into walking encyclopedias with questionable social skills, making a phone call was an adventure, an art form, and sometimes a comedy routine. You'd pick up the phone, a clunky piece of plastic that was more weapon than device, and dial that magical number, zero. Enter the operator, the unsung hero of telecommunication, the human Google, the guide in the labyrinth of long-distance calling. Need to call Aunt Edna in London? Confused about whether it's AM or PM there? Fear not, the operator was there to connect your call, offer a weather update, and maybe even share a recipe for meatloaf. This was a time when ghosting meant your line was haunted by actual static, not the sudden mysterious silence of a text conversation. The operator was a voice of reassurance in the vast, silent void of the telephone network. You could almost picture them sitting in a room with a thousand cords like a telephone octopus, connecting lovebirds and businessmen alike. And oh, the drama of a collect call. Will you accept the charges from John? The operator would ask. You waited with bated breath. Would they accept or wouldn't they? It was like the finale of a soap opera every single time. But it wasn't all fun and games. Mischievous kids would dial zero just to ask the operator the time or the meaning of life. Because why not? Google wasn't a thing yet and Siri was just a twinkle in a programmer's eye. In this era, dropping a call meant you literally dropped the phone and the only airplane mode was sticking your head out of the car window. The operator navigated through all of this with the grace of a ballroom dancer and the patience of a saint. So here's to the operators, the unsung heroes of yesteryear's telecommunication. In a world where talking to a human on the phone is as rare as a unicorn sighting, we salute you. You made the world a little smaller, one call at a time, and for that, we're eternally grateful and a little bit nostalgic. Did you ever call the operator? Let us know in the comments.